With more people alive on Earth than ever before, a number that rose above 7 billion in 2019, organizations around the world are heavily focused on increasing our food supply. Smart farming is really just bringing the world around us to the field of agriculture. So for instance, cameras and monitors and sensors, a lot of people don't really think about it now in their everyday lives. They jump in their car and they have a backup camera. But smart farming will help increase food production uh, just by giving the farmer better data and allowing him to make better decisions, better timing. So when he goes to harvest, it's not just on a whim, it's very calculated. So it's really bringing better decision making that really affect his bottom line and his overall production. With volatile commodity prices and declining farm income, producers are in search of better tools to help them reduce risk and increase sustainability on the farm. When the rotary combine was first introduced, it greatly increased capacity for the farmer. So as yields were greater, they could harvest more faster. The downside to that greater capacity was there was more loss. Rotor loss happens from an overloaded separation section. It's also known as volunteer yield. So what happens is the crop comes into the machine, it's either not threshed quickly enough or the separation section becomes overloaded and not all the grain is separated from the crop mat and it ends up going out the back of the machine lost on the ground. And that's just lost yield and lost production. Today, Precision farming and the tools and devices it comprises is helping farmers gather and analyze real-time data for better decision-making. Precision in agriculture is really the essence of smart farming. Everything in precision agriculture up to this point has really been focused on the planting side and automation. So tractors have auto steer, for example. There are sensors that detect weeds, so only the weeds are sprayed and there's no waste. The part of agriculture that's really been overlooked is on the harvest side and precision harvesting. The combines over the years have gotten more horsepower, more technology inside the cab, sensors, but there hasn't been really a whole lot of innovation in the, in the harvest side of things. And that's really what we've brought to the table. Engineered and developed to be the most advanced concave system available, the XPR system threshes all crops, reduces grain loss, and significantly improves grain quality and storability. The XPR Concave product is essentially a concave that was designed to help farmers in the field. A couple things that it does is it helps to reduce time in the field, uh, provide a cleaner sample, it actually allows them to speed up and gain some capacity, and on top of that they don't have to switch out the concave, so they're using one concave for all crops. Our concave system is composed of three essential elements. We have threshing concaves, cover plates, and an extreme separation grate. Something that really puts our concaves above the rest is that we're significantly more open than OEM concaves, so we're allowed to release the grain sooner and get it down onto the argers faster. One of the biggest benefits of the XPR concave is the fact that we have a large threshing bar. The XPR concave bar is significantly larger than an OEM concave. Uh, it also has a notch pattern to it, so we have 135% more threshing surface area than a standard OEM concave, and that really helps for slowing the rotor down when you're harvesting. Uh, one of the greatest contributors to grain damage is running very fast and tight against a standard OEM concave. So with our threshing bar, we can actually slow that rotor down force more material to rub on itself and essentially eliminate the grain damage. So the extreme separation grate is a part of our concave system and we consider it basically our last line of defense. It has larger fingers that protrude more into the separation section. What that does is it disrupts the flow of the trash or wheat straw, corn shucks, anything like that that would take or carry that crop out of the back of the machine and end up on the ground as volunteer yield. So instead, those fingers are disrupting the flow and capturing that grain that would be going into the grain tank. On average, rotor combines lose three to five bushels per acre, equating to $30,000 year after year. The XPR concave system is helping put money back in farmers' pockets with substantial return on investment. The XPR concave system helps put money back in the farmer's pockets in a handful of ways. One being less time in the field, so less fuel consumption, you're saving money that way. Second would be the volunteer yield issue. If we are capturing the grain sooner and putting it into the grain tank, that's less that's being lost on the field. Another reason is our cleaner grain sample that we provide. 
The XPR system helps improve grain quality by being more forgiving to the crop. So if we're running a slower rotor speed and increasing the concave clearance, we can actually do less damage to that crop. And that really will go over to the farmer's side, especially in their pocket, because if you are doing less damage to your grain, you're getting a more premium on your crop at the elevator and essentially getting less stockage. Probably the biggest difference that we noticed right away was the grain quality. The sample was much better. No fines, no broken cobs, no white caps, no pieces of straw or weed heads anymore. That's just grain in the tank and that's the way it's supposed to be. With this XPR system, now we've basically eliminated our dockage totally. Other than that was the rotor loss. Before, it was either one of the two things, either you were cleaning the sample or you were throwing it out the back or you weren't throwing anything out the back and you had a terrible sample. And with this system, we've cut down rotor loss significantly and when you're not running the concave up fast and tight to the rotor as much, it's less fuel consumption, less of a load on the machine. We run the concaves a lot different than what we were used to with the stock round bars or small wires. Not having to switch out in between crops anymore, I can switch out a two pound cover plate in just a few minutes and jumped about 30% more on our capacity. SS Performance Concaves is essentially the precision planning for the harvest industry because our product is actually focusing more on the threshing that's taking place in the machine, and it's actually going to take the technology that's already in the machine and just make that better product. These larger companies are really focused on the data collection, and you know now we have cameras in there, kind of keeping track of everything that's going on, but they're not really getting down to the fact that the threshing is very important, especially when you're trying to focus on that grain sample. If you have all of this data collection and feedback and these cameras taking place and you're not getting down to the sole issue of the grain damage or the rotor loss, then essentially you can't solve the problem like we can. For more information, visit EstesPerformanceConcaves.com.